Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel for a new figure preview. Today Hot Toys has announced their Peacemaker figure. Yep, we got that while we are waiting for figures from the book of Boba Fett. That is definitely a choice. I get that the show was recently renewed, so I guess it makes sense to announce that figure, but come on, where are Cat Bane, Cobbanth, Crescenten and Boba from the book of Boba Fett? We are also still waiting on the Andrew and Toby Spider-Man figures. There are so many more interesting characters than Peacemaker. I didn't like the Suicide Squad and most of all I hated that character. I watched the trailer for his series and I'm not interested at all to watch it. And well, we don't have HBO Max over here, so it's not possible anyway. Though, I'm happy for collectors who were waiting for a Peacemaker figure. They didn't make one for the Suicide Squad, but at least you're getting one for his series. He has exactly the same outfits. First, the head sculpt. There is no head sculpt without the helmet, which is weird. Maybe they'll announce one later on, but I'm not sure. Though, for the helmeted version, you have different possib possibilities of display. It has a big open mouth, and you can insert a tongue there. Depending on how you place the tongue, it either seems like he's doing a pukan of face, or just sticking his tongue out. When you have a crazy character like Peacemaker, you can go with a neutral facial expression. You have to go with something crazy, and Hot Toys did it. Viva Lay has done a great job on this helmeted head sculpt. As for the figure, the outfit is mostly using fabric. There is a little bit of pleather on the sides of the shirt and the pants, but it's not going to be a problem for displaying your figure considering where it is. The boots are made of plastic, same as, same as the clothes. There is also pieces of plastic on his shirt, including a symbol. Surprisingly, the elbows have visible articulation. They didn't go seamless. That doesn't look as good, but if you get a Peacemaker figure, you want to give him sick poses, so I understand why they went this way. At least you won't have to worry about damaging your figure all the time because of how you display him. In terms of accessories, he comes with different hands, his eagle with open wings and closed wings, an axe, a sword, and a display base featuring an old American flag and the logo of the series, plus a name plate. There is also a gun, but it's in the Ulster, it doesn't seem removable. That is really weird, um, I don't know what happened here. As for the price, it's on pre-order at Sideshow Collectibles for $275, which is quite reasonable. For me, you can obviously guess it's an easy pass. Thanks again for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye!